आत्म फोरे सकने फल सृजना शक्ति संसार में कहीं हो फल नमस्ते सैजोला जजोला पाप प्रणाम दिस इज प्रदीप भंडारी फ्रम मदलाइन सेकेंडरी स्कूल पोखरा आई एम एटीन इयर्स ओल्ड एंड करेन्टली इन ग्रेट टूल्व I would like to start off by expressing my humble gratitude to Nepal Astronomical Society, shortly known as NASA, for organizing this wonderful platform to express my vision on the given theme, Women in Space. Participation and representation of humanity in space has been an issue ever since the first phase of space exploration. Up till 12, Yuri Gagarin became the first person in space as he orbited the Earth in the Vostok spacecraft. Three years later, In June 16, 1963, Russian cosmonaut Valentina Tereshkova became the first woman to go to space with a solo mission on the Vostok 6. A bird cannot fly with one wing only. Human space flight cannot develop any further without the active participation of women, said Valentina Tereshkova, and well, it seems true. 19 years passed between this historic flight and the next space flight by another woman. Then, Svetlana continued the trail and became second woman in space in mission Soyuz T-7 and the first to do a space walk. It is a marvelous achievement indeed, isn't it? All of a sudden, I realized the number of women who have been to space. From the very first space flight to present, 574 people have been able to exit the atmosphere and with heavy heart, I must tell you that only 65 of them are women. It is approximately 11% of the whole. This hit me hard and I questioned myself the reason behind this massive disparity and I brainstormed much and guess what? I found the answer. It is quite simple. Women aren't capable to be part of his team. They are insignificant. They are too, they are too, in the, too weak to compete in this men's world, isn't it? If not, then why are we all feeling hell with these pointless beliefs? I wonder why. Women might not be same or equal to men in the biological sense, but in terms of logic, reasoning, responsibilities, they are equal. If that point is true, then May Coral Jeminson, first black woman in space, wouldn't have been there. Similarly, if that statement is right, Peggy Whitson wouldn't have spent the most total time in space and first woman to command the ISS. When you think of space science and exploration, I bet none of us pictures a woman. We need to change this patriarchy of mind, mindset as soon as possible. Women should not limit themselves in household chores, doing dishes, taking care of babies and all that stuff. We need to let them think and feel out of the box. Believe me, believe me, they are meant to explore the universe. They have just as equal right to observe how mesmerizing our art looks from the space. It is well said that people who are crazy enough to think that they can change the world are the ones who do. Don't you want to be that crazy person? Don't you want to be the one to break the stereotypes and pave the path for the young ones who will dream to be the next you? From 1960 onwards, women like Tereshkova, Sally Ride, May Carroll break the, broke the barriers and made history, paving the path for other females to become astronauts and go to space. It is tough, but trust me, it's not impossible either. You can be the one to break the stereotype and become the first Nepali woman to be there in space. Don't let your head down. Instead, look up to the moon and the stars and see how pretty they shine. Think of yourself somewhere there one day. Waiting for opportunities to come up isn't gonna make your dream, dream come true. You have to fight for it. Do not forget, everything seems impossible until and unless they are achieved. You may face body shaming, ragging, sexism, but never give up. Make a role model and start working for what you, what you dream. Women from Nepal like Manisa Dua have been inspiring young girls young girls to grow their interest in space science and technology. Hats off to those heroes because of whom the near future looks bright for aspiring women space travelers around the world. The journey that started with Valentina Tereshkova will continue to carry millions of dreams into the space and explore and grow. Jai Nepal, thank you.